Dad, guess what? In science class today, we got to learn about DNA. So I thought, wouldn't it be cool to learn where our family is from? You mean like genealogy? Exactly, like making a family tree. That sounds like so much fun. I know some of the family have done genealogy work already. Maybe you could reach out to them. That's a great idea. I've looked up some apps online and they make it very easy. Let's look online at some of the reviews and see which app ranks the highest. I am so excited. Thank you, Dad. Grandma, how old is Great Aunt Olive? Your Aunt Olive. Now, she was born in May of 1921, which was a few years after World War I. So that will make her 103 next month. You have two new messages. Hello, Lizzie. My name's Rick. I'm new to this Ancestry site, but find it really interesting. I have family with your last name. Maybe we have some family that are connected. Hey, sorry for the late reply. I didn't know there was a chat thing on here. My name is quite unique, so maybe we do have family connections. I did some research on a few other Ancestry resources and looks like we do have some connections. Where do you live? I live in Wyoming, but my mom's family is from Utah and England on my dad's side. Where are you? Oh, that's interesting. We definitely have family connections as some of my family grew up in Utah. They are part of a group called the Sons and Daughters of the Utah Pioneers. My grandpa in Utah is a member too. How old are you, Lizzie? I'm 14 years old. Wow, you are very mature for your age. My son Craig has just turned 16, and I'm trying to get him interested in genealogy too. Maybe you could help, you are very pretty, and I think he'd really like you. Did I say something wrong? I haven't heard from you in a few days. I passed on your profile details to Craig, and he reached out to you. Sorry, I had a lot of schoolwork to get done. I'll go and check his message now. Hi, baby. My dad gave me your information. He says like you like this, this genealogy, genealogy stuff and are really excited about it. I don't really, really like, like all that, that. But he says you might help me and we have a shared family tree. Hey, Craig. Yes, it's fun and I really enjoy building my family tree. I like walking my dog. You have a dog? I have a cat called Susie. I like dogs too. What's his name? His name is Fang, like from, from Harry, Harry Potter. Potter. Fang is a pound dog my dad and I picked him up from the shelter. Would you like to see a picture? Sure, my dad also picked up our cat from the rehoming shelter. I'll send you a picture of her, too. All my family are big Harry Potter fans. Love the name. Baby, we should start to date. Be, be like, like serious. You are so mature and really beautiful, so photogenic. You could be a model, and I really like you. I'm looking for someone to marry and make happy. I can take Here, care of you. you and buy you nice things? Do you want that, too? I'm not even 16 yet, and my parents don't want me dating till then. You are very sweet, and thank you for the compliments. Baby, we should at least meet up and go watch a movie or something just to see if we like each other. I totally get about I'm not, not dating, dating till you are 16. We can be friends till then. I can wait, baby. Let's watch a movie as friends. We are so close in age, baby. Hi, I'm looking for Craig. I'm Rick, Craig's dad. He felt terrible about not being here and asked if I could be here to explain. His dog, Fang. Yes, he showed me pictures of him. Fang got loose last night and ran off. We were searching all night, but don't worry. Someone found him and called the number on the collar. And Craig had to go and pick Fang up before the person who found him went to work. Oh my gosh, I am so glad Fang is safe and sound. Poor Craig, he must have been sick of worry. He didn't get any sleep and was still searching when it got light. He feels really bad about not being here. I understand. It would be a shame to waste the tickets and they're non-refundable. And you look so pretty all dressed up. Thank you. If I tell you what, why don't I join you? And if Craig makes it, he can take the seat. I guess that'd be okay.
I was supposed to be meeting his son, Craig. Rick told me that Craig had lost his dog and couldn't come and meet me. His real name is Dean, and he's on the sex offenders register. He doesn't actually have a son. Can you allow us access to the conversation thread for our investigation? Of course, and thank you. I really appreciate you giving me the details for the Teton County Community Safety Network. They recommended a wonderful therapist, and I'm now getting the support I need. Sexual harassment and discrimination on the basis of sex is not tolerated at JHHS. All students have the right to feel safe in a school environment. If you or someone you know needs support, please contact a trusted adult or peer advocate today. The counseling department can offer accommodations that may lessen interaction with the alleged perpetrator.